go. Uh, I assume they're just, like, breaking each other's bones, Aqua. That's my current guess. They didn't have Stu's advice to not break a bone, and now they're just all about breaking their bones. What are you thinking of changing to, Aqua? Avionics. I assume that's related to aviation? Like something about the physics of flying? Electrical systems on aircrafts, that makes sense. can confirm working from home is nice, especially on the gas. Although it would be especially, especially for you, since as I recall it's a bit of a commute for you to get there. And yeah, if you could get into that, Aqua, that sounds like it could be a, a good, uh, good career. <laughs> Don't know about the periodic table? Oh gosh. Uh, say what you're gonna say, Horns, and I'll tell you if I get the choke or not. Under three today, that's pretty good.
<laughs> Fair horns. I do get that one then. It's a good bit. I learned like half of the Elements song when I was a kid. Kinda wanna learn the rest of it someday. <laughs> Not so much as, like, even a party trick or anything, just because sometimes the first half gets stuck in my head and it would be nice to know the rest so I can finish it and get it out of my head. I doubt I even know half anymore, honestly. I only know the first, like, verse or something. How much do I know about golf, the sport, or the person? Two questions. Okay, so I know everything about the sport. Uh, ask me any question about golf the sport, and I will answer it. Um, golf the person, also literally everything. It is scary how much I know about Golf Kid. But I will not answer any questions about golf. Um, golf the person, out of respect for his privacy. Who won the biggest golf tournament in 1976? Some guy. You're welcome. <laughs> Noi. Noi did. GG <laughs> Noi, honestly. Well played. I'm gonna go ahead and say, uh, Noi won all of them. The four tournaments, the four major golf tournaments. There's the Bug Cup, um, the, uh, the Masters, of course, um, Bug Tourney Australia, and, uh, PGA. How about that? How about all that golf knowledge I just dropped on you? Go 
Evolve World USA and Spyrothon. Spyrothon is my favorite golf tournament. <laughs> Cloudy. I learned the German word for cloudy the other day. What was it? Was it provoked? It was cloudy? And then I also learned foggy, which had a, a G at the end of it, I think. Like a lot of temperatures seem to. Temperatures. A lot of weathers. Yeah, honestly, Golf, if I had to make an actual guess, I would have said Jack Nicholas. I I think that was around the time that he was big, right? And he's one of the, like, four golfers I could name. Two of the other ones being you and Lucas. German IG is like the English Y. That's a good way to think about it, Horns. Also, Horns, I'm pretty sure what you just typed in chat is not the words I've learned. I don't know what Schildkrot means, but... It's not, not anything I have said until just now. I'm pretty sure Cloudy is bevoked. I think that's what Duolingo told me, at least. Alexa leveled up to 55. Let's go. Well done, Alexa. Well earned. What's the other one? Zonig is sunny. Regnet is rainy. Gosh, I need to practice. <laughs> Clearly. There were like seven weather terms that I learned, and I'm forgetting all of them. Or I guess Regnet is not rainy, it's raining, but... Horns, what does Schildekrote mean? I'm also pronouncing that really weird, but like... That's definitely not a word I've learned. What is... Does it mean turtles? <laughs> It means cloudy and foggy? And it's a word I don't know! There's gotta be some kind of context for when you would use that, that, uh, that is getting lost on me. Just the one turtle. I want to say one of the words I learned, it was schlecht? And it it's something you would say to just describe, like, the weather is bad. Es ist schlecht heute. That kind of thing. It is bad today. Am I right about that? Schlecht might mean something totally different, it also might just not be a word. 
No. Get out of this ice cavern. Schlecht is bad. Okay, okay. So I remembered another word. So it's Zonig, Regnet, Schlecht, Bewölkt. There were three other words I learned. One of them was foggy. One of them was snowing, which is Schneit, maybe? Maybe. <laughs> also, this is my best pace by a good chunk. By, like, at least five seconds. <laughs> maybe closer to ten seconds? This is a really good pace, is the point. Neblich. That's the word I wanted. Neblich. Oh god, I took another damage. You're kidding! I mean, that it's not like that kills the best pace. I get another fodder pretty soon, but that's just unfortunate. Sorry, that happens sometimes in, um, in the end of Ice Cavern. You get hit by the last snowball guy. Schneien is sh snowing? That's not the conjugation I learned. I must have learned snowy? Which I, I don't know... I don't know exactly what that would be, but... Interesting. Yeah, it did start with SCH though, I remember that much at least. For sure. Bedecked? What a beautiful word, Dorito. I was only able to glance at it for a moment, but I hope I saw that right. Veshnite? I think it might have just been Schneit, is what Duolingo taught me. Learning so many words. Schneit means it snows? Hmm. Interesting. You know, I never did look up, like, how good Duolingo is at teaching language. There's a chance these German lessons are just, like, trash. Schnee is snow. I see. I see. Like, I'm probably... I am learning, you know, actual German words, but... Not necessarily... Useful or common conjugations or phrases or anything. But I'm also still super early in it, so we'll see, we'll see. I kind of wanted that fodder. I'll get to die soon, and that'll reset Sparks. Sorry, I was just... I'm still thinking about Sparks. This is lower than I usually like to be, but I don't think it matters for too much longer. As long as I don't take damage early in peak, I think I should be fine on Sparks.
Horns is back. Let's go. Mr. Blue back there? Yeah. Bonking on that golem recently, and that's a new problem. I'm not not entirely sure what's up with that. I did horns, it's true. Horns. Uh did you hear about the woman who caught her husband cheating? after she found all of his letters. I guess this is a rhetorical question. I don't actually need to wait for a response from Horns in chat. But, uh, she said that she's never gonna play Scrabble with him again. in this very channel. There we go. Yeah. Well, it's okay, because you know what they say. Repetition is the key to comedy. Repetition is the key to comedy. Repetition is the key to comedy. That's what they say, you know. Did you know that, Horns? <laughs> Yo, Pander. Sheep. <laughs> Me when repetition is the key to comedy. True. How are you doing, Pander? I haven't played any more Yanyu yet, unfortunately, because Spyro has fully consumed my mind and soul. But I think... I think I'm close to exercising out my Spyro demons. And, uh... And I'll be able to let in some Yanya demons soon. <laughs> Is it to make text only games? Uh, I mean, it depends on what you want to do with it, but overall, not as hard as it is to make other games. Also, like, it depends on what tools you're willing to use, because that's the thing, there are a bunch of tools for it. If you're like, I only know C, and I want to make a text based game from scratch, have fun with that. <laughs> Pick a number, zero or one. Uh, one. You have Game Maker? Pick a better tool for making a text-only game. That's my advice. 
Also, again, this is my best Magic Crafters pace by about five seconds. You have Godot. Aqua, there are so many tools out there for making text-only games. <laughs> How did I jump under that gem? That was amazing! Aqua, I am not responding to you anymore. What happens after the number selection? I won. That's what happened. Because I'm awesome. That was all about strategy. I jumped too low. That was Dumbo mistake. Classic bozo move. Jumping too low. Only thing worse than jumping too low would have been picking zero in Horns' number game. Oh, let's go, Alexa. Very nice. weird position where I haven't really made any major mistakes in a while, but like my movement is just not particularly good. <laughs> it's good enough. If I keep playing like this, record should be fine, but like, <laughs> I'm just not playing that well. What was that noise? Oh, somebody blew up the Capitol building. <laughs> That's my yoga instructor's first day on the job. Very good. I assume it was those uh, high children and their loud rap music. I don't think it was even rap. It was just really bassy. I <laughs> there was too much bass for me to figure out what genre of music it was. Noi did that. Let's go, Noi. That young people music. You blew it up. Honestly, that makes a lot of sense. An important question about the history of cinema. Share with me your important question about the history of cinema. Keep your horns on. Meryl Streep versus Stanley Kubrick in a game of Scrabble? 
who wins and why. Meryl Streep, because Stanley Kubrick's actually an idiot. Clearly <laughs> because she's alive. That, you know, that does make a pretty big difference. Here's the thing about Scrabble. There is quite a bit of randomness in the game, of course. Uh, but on average, the better player will beat the worst player. And, like, at least seven games out of ten, the living player is going to beat the dead player. Dustin, yo five crab. We were just talking about Scrabble. Speaking of Scrabble, Dustin Dude and Five Crab are both very good Scrabble players. How was your stream? What were you up to? Uh, I'm gonna not because I actually got the double, the double chest, not the double stone, not. Called Cattle and Scrabble. What is Cattle and Scrabble? Is is Cattle in a language? Is that an Italian dialect, or am I thinking of something else? I'm probably thinking of something else. I don't know what I'm thinking of. Never assume that I know what I'm talking about. I'm a huge idiot. It's a romance language. Oh, I was close. Closer to Spanish. Okay. I don't know why I flamed that guy. I never get that guy's gem. <laughs> that would be really fun, Horns. When are they gonna make that? Well, that's fun, Dustin Dude. I currently have another tab open for a copy of French Pal PS1 Scrabble. which I, uh, I will probably buy tonight. Because <laughs> here's the thing, regular PAL PS1 Scrabble already lets you play in English and Spanish and German, but as it turns out, they had a second PAL PS1 Scrabble that was French only. Because France does love their Scrabble. <laughs> What's up, BM64? I mean, it's just, it's just true, so... <laughs> Rachel Richards also loves their Scrabble. Very true, very true. Does it have an updated dictionary versus playing French on English? What do you mean by playing French on English, Ragey? English Pal Scrabble only has English, German, and Spanish. It does not have French. This was made at the same time by the same company. I caught that gem. What about bonjour? I assume bonjour is in there. Only 
legal words or lyrics in Springsteen songs, that would actually be really fun horns. <laughs> I I would probably really enjoy playing that with you. <laughs> Hold on, I actually really need to focus here. This is one of the harder levels. I made it easier than it was, but it's still hard. How are the cats? They're doing better. They're doing better. They've both been eating. Uh, Tobin is being more exploratory. Princess is still mostly staying under the bed, but, uh, but she's eating and she's drinking. Dang! That's so unfortunate. I don't know why I've been missing that again. When I started doing this route, that proxy was fine, but... Not so much anymore. The last few runs I've been missing it. I wondered about that, Ragey. I, uh, I'm not sure. I'm really not sure. Because I've kind of wanted to do something like that. Some kind of Scrabble online system that is just, like, as customizable as you want to make it. If you want to just, like, totally change the shape of the board, go for it. If you want to change where all the bonus tiles are, you go nuts. I assume the biggest thing holding it back is just, like, number of people interested. Because it is a good chunk of work for something that... I don't know. I feel like Woogles is just about the best Scrabble site we're gonna get, and how many people use it? I don't know, maybe I'm... Maybe I'm... <sighs> oh my god. I can't believe that just happened. That's extremely frustrating. That's fine, it's fine. I... I should actually stop reading chat for a minute. This is a hard level. I gotta, I gotta dial into the game. I also did not see how many gems I had coming into the level, so... I'm gonna be getting maybe a few more than I normally might. Because I've dropped quite a few gems over the course of this run. Are you serious? No way! Ah, it's really bad. chat and only saw, has anyone ever called you Xander Tosto? No, Pander, I don't think anybody has. No. Oh, this is such a bad passage. I'm losing, like, all of the time that I was ahead here. Oh, noe. Not all the time. Oh, I still need to play well for the rest of the run, but... 
That was that was a disappointing dark passage to say the least. His donator. Do attacks, Nestor. all coming apart at the end. Oh, and I needed that five. Oh well, maybe I didn't. Wait, is that even a five? I think it's a five. No! I didn't have the height on that jump. Why not? What did I do wrong? Okay. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. Extremely unfortunate ending, but honestly, we can still get the record with this. Still do not understand how to flame charge that guy. I do it sometimes. I've done it before. It's just a funky one. Why is there an 80 Dragons category now that there's always been an 80 Dragons category? There's been an 80 Dragons category for longer than I've been playing the game. Y what? You don't need loot for 80 Dragons? What? Aqua, learn your dragons. I also was not paying attention to how many gems I had coming in here. I was too busy raging about the 80 dragons question. Why do I keep looking at chat and sabotaging myself? It's fine. It should probably be these gems. Just knowing me, knowing the gems I've had recently, it's probably gonna be the gems I'm getting now and it'll be enough. And if it's not, that's a bummer. <laughs> but you know what? This run wasn't perfect anyway. It was a great start. It was a fantastic start with just a really mediocre ending. <laughs> Also, Aqua, a bunch of people have done early loot now. There's a pseudo-120 category that does it. A bunch. There's like three people on that leaderboard, but, you know. People have done it. <laughs> 360, and I'm getting 15 more out here. I think I'll be fine. Uh, crud. Oh well. If we uh if we get first try tooth roll, I think we can barely world record by like a second. And, you know, also do, like, everything else in Nasty's world correctly. Just do Rat. Rat doesn't help. 
I guess rat would help, but no, actually it wouldn't. Rat would be worse. Rat would be objectively worse than tooth roll. Because you want to go into nasty Nork Sparksless, and if you do rat, you have to get fodder. But do rat? No. Suggest I only do gulp skip instead? If it was here, I would so much prefer gulp skip to tooth roll. Oh my goodness, Gulp Skip would be a million times easier. I do feel... <sighs> Never mind. I do feel like people overestimate the difficulty of Gulp Skip. It's really hard to learn, but then once you know it, it's pretty free. Um, again, run's not over. I have messed up so many other parts of this, of the end game, and I'm also not even positive that I'm that I'm good enough. Like, I want to say Ash, Ash's Dreamweaver split was a 44:30, and I got like a 44:43. Ash just also missed Tooth Roll for a while, so like, we'll see, we'll see. And then again, I also need to skip the credits, which I have been less consistent at than I would like. Okay, well, that's helpful. That's encouraging. Again, it's gonna be really close. That's exactly right, Bagel. You need to go into and out of Nasty, uh, definitely, to get the 80th Dragon, but you only need to go into Twilight. So it saves you load. <sighs> it's gonna be close. We might tie it, honestly. We might tie the record. <laughs> also, I, in a very cursory glance, I think it is faster to stay on the path than to go across the water. Honestly, Aqua, I would almost prefer 44. No, we've got this. This is it. I was gonna say, I would almost prefer a 44, because it would mean that I would have reason and motivation to keep running the category. Gross. <laughs> I can't believe that. What a garbage Dreamweavers. I lost like 30 seconds, at least, in Dreamweavers. God. <laughs> I did it! I did it. I shouldn't... I did it. I'm happy I did it. It's been a while since I, like, had a record I had to work for a little bit. Sparksless was the last time. Sparksless back in 2021. It's nice. It feels good. It feels good. Because I've been in a weird spot with this game for a while. Where, um, like, I'm clearly good at this game. Uh, not to, like, you know, start bragging or anything, but, like, I am good at this game. But also, I'm not really in record contention for anything. <laughs> Except this, apparently. Like, I'm not getting the Vortex record. I'm not interested in going for the Vortex record. Um, I'm not going for any percent or 120 or cheap percent. Uh, I... 
Pseudo 120 I could get, but like it'd be tough. It's just like this and Sparkless 120 I'm interested in getting back. Uh, there's something I want to look at just out of curiosity. I need to remember when I did some things. When did I first get the Vortex record? It was late 2019, right? Maybe September 2019? Interesting. I Okay, I was right. Um... <laughs> sorry, when I first got the Vortex record, Vortex had fewer runners than 80 Dragons has right now. And yet, I think this run is significantly less optimized than Vortex was back then. And it's just cool seeing how the community has grown. That's that's what I was interested in seeing. The size of the leaderboards and the less optimized categories. <laughs> thank you, Pepsi. And thank you for the GG's, everybody, and thank you for the Bits horns. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, I've had two ads playing over each other recently as well. It's really funny. But, yeah. And thank you, Pepsi, for the 80 Dragons copy pasta. <laughs> also, Golf, that is a good movie meme. Oh, how big was cheat percent when I got the record there? God, cheat percent has 55 runners. Cheat percent surely is smaller than it was when I had the record there. Because, I mean, for so long, cheat percent only had, like, 12 people. <laughs> when did I get that record? Was it 2020 sometime? Yes. At the very least, in May of 2020, Cheat Percent only had 15 runners <laughs> at a time when I had the record. Anyway, um... I feel a lot of things about this. I'm not gonna keep grinding it right now, of course, but like... I don't know, there, it's it's a weird thing. With both Cheat Percent and Vortex, when I, and Sparkless 120 for that matter, when I got those records, I don't think of myself as someone who likes to grind categories. I say this a lot. I just, I don't enjoy doing that. Um, so when I got those records, it wasn't as much like, haha, look at me, I'm the best. I mean, there was that feeling a little bit because it feels nice, but like, it was mostly me finding new things and trying to show the community how cool this thing is and how much further it could go. And I would get the record, and then I would just hand it off to whoever actually wanted to do the work to optimize it. But, like, I kinda suspect that nobody else is gonna come take my place here anytime soon. I mean, I could be wrong. Maybe Ash has been champing at the bit to get back to 80 dragons. <laughs> but given... Your comments about Tooth Roll, I assume, no, you're not that interested in coming back to this anytime soon. Maybe Laura would, but Laura, I assume you're off doing your own other thing at the moment and not dying to get back into S1. And I haven't heard anything from Wally in a long time. Um, so I don't know, like, if I don't improve this myself, I don't know when somebody else would. I kind of want to, I kind of want to just see if I can get a 47 in this sometime. I know it's doable. I feel pretty good about the route now. I might make splits sometime. Actually, like, really seriously go for it. And I think now that I have the record and there's no pressure to beat somebody else, I would be just more comfortable just doing runs for the fun of it, for the silliness of it. I mean, today was a, a good day, mentally, for runs. 
I was messing up a ton, but not like... I can find 47 minutes, dragons? I think I can, Pepsi. You got this, Horns. You're right on my tail. I believe it. Want people to optimize your Scrabble runs? I understand that feeling, Five Crab. <laughs> it's one of the fun and interesting things about speedrunning, where, like, the drive is to beat everybody else so you can be on top, but also you want a lot of other people doing it as well so that you can, like, have people you're interacting with. This is a social activity. Anyway, this feels really good. I think I'm going to do a little bit more Yanya and then call the stream, because I've got an hour, two hours before I want to go to bed. So we'll do some more, uh, more Yanya challenges. <laughs> Not enough people to be better than, yeah. I need to do another lose to novice run. That was a lot of fun. And I was playing it up a bit, but obviously there's tons of time to save in my run, because I was playing, like, extremely cautiously. I was playing like a nervous wreck. It has cooled down, Eliza. It was in the 90s today. Otherwise, don't even start. If you're going to try, go all the way. Thank you for the life advice, Pepsi. Dustin did get a really good loose to novice run. Did you guys keep your recordings of those? I can actually make a miscellaneous category for that we could put those wads up on. Happy sheep. could mean losing girlfriends, wives, relatives, jobs, and maybe even your mind. It could mean not eating for three or four days. It could mean freezing on a park bench. It could mean jail. It could mean derision, mockery, isolation. Isolation is the gift. That's what I'm talking about. Amazing. Dang, Pepsi. E-E-N-O-T-T-S. It's almost stone knot. Kinda. Um... Hmm. Okay. Yanya. Yanya, Yanya, Yanya. Gonna put Spyro back in the case and then fling it across the room so I don't play it for weeks. <laughs> <laughs> 